Hey everybody, welcome back. So today is Wednesday, uh, another day in CS125. I hope that for those of you that took the midterm yesterday, things turned out okay. Um, we'll talk on the forum um, about how to interpret your midterm uh, results, but you know, one way to think about this is this is sort of a diagnostic. Uh, where are you at this point in the class? Um, if you earned a score on the midterm, if you felt comfortable with the midterm questions, um, and you feel you know good about things, then you're probably in pretty good shape. Um, you know, if you were able to solve most of the programming questions, or at least you had some idea of what you were doing. You know, maybe you didn't quite get the solution because you ran out of time or you made some small mistake. That's okay. Um, but if you were really befuddled by what was on the midterm and there were some concepts there that were really confusing to you and you didn't know where to start, um, please reach out to the course staff because. Um, you know, we have a lot in front of us throughout the rest of the semester and we're going to keep going and we're going to be learning new things. Um, right now, however, there is a little bit of time to kind of catch up because we've moved into this new unit where we're talking about a different set of concepts. And so if you need to reach back and kind of review some of those imperative programming ideas, uh, it's a good time to do that. We will come back to some of those concepts and some of those ideas. So, you know, we're into the second half of the class right now. And then the third half of the class, we kind of bring together some of the new things we're learning with some of the old ideas that we started with. Um, and we do some really beautiful things together with them. So that's what's coming. Um, but all to say that, you know, uh, use your midterm score the way that you would use any of your other quiz scores as a diagnostic tool to help you make adjustments in terms of how you approach the class and how you approach the material. Because um, we have a long way to go and we have a lot of new things to learn together. So um, today's lesson is a lot of fun. I will see you at the bottom.